down 11 o'clock. We're following breaking news in Southern California. Not just the shaking, these flames have a lot of people feeling uneasy. But we're learning about the earthquake that hit the L.A. area. And breaking news regarding Governor Newsom. Two of his children have tested positive for COVID. What the governor's office is telling us late tonight. And defending her decision, Mayor Breed responding to being maskless inside of a San Francisco nightclub. My drink was sitting at the table. I got up and started dancing because I was feeling the spirit. The reason the mayor says she was following her own COVID guidelines. And this is good news for Northern California. Rain on the radar. I'll show you where the heaviest is headed. You won't want to miss my forecast. Good evening, I'm Roger mm. Mathai. We begin with that breaking news in Southern California. A magnitude 4.3 earthquake rattling parts of L.A. This hit just before 8 p.m. centered in the city of Carson. You can see the map there. It's about 13 miles south of LAX. We're also seeing flaring at a nearby refinery. We're told this is a normal safety precaution after an earthquake to burn off any excess gas and relieve pressure from the system. Nonetheless, pretty alarming to see for people living nearby. Crews at LAX checking the tarmac and the terminals. No reports, thankfully, of any damage or delayed flights. Now, was there an early warning here? The MyShake app did send out a warning in the L.A. region before this earthquake struck. Social media also lit up. So far, no reports of any injuries or damage. Also breaking at this hour, the pandemic hitting close to home for Governor Newsom. Two of his four children have tested positive for COVID. The Newsom family scare comes as COVID infections in children are on the rise nationwide. Here's NBC Bay Area's Cheryl Hurd.